Arizona State opened up Game 3 with a two-run homer. But this was all that Texas would allow as they defeated the Sun Devils with a 4-2 victory to move on to the College World Series. Some great baseball this weekend. I think all the games were of a very high quality and hard fought and uh, really tested the makeup of all the players involved. So uh, I thought they did a great job. It's been, it was the same you know, from yesterday and Friday. We had great, uh, great atmosphere. Our, our guys in the dugout kept us going. And... Uh, we know how we play with our backs up against the wall, and uh, when they jumped out, we know we had, we know we had to answer back. And uh, I think our guys in the in the dugout and, um, really kept us going. The Longhorns took the longest road possible to get to Omaha after overcoming several elimination games. The team has proved that pressure is not a threat, but they'd prefer to stay in the winners bracket in their mission to claim the title. That's, I'm extremely proud of them. That's what this team has been all about. It's been about taking the blows that you have to take in baseball and coming back from them. And, and that's what they did. I don't really understand it. We, uh, we've done it all year, and that's just kind of the character of our team. We play best with our backs against the wall. So, um, I mean, Coach Greedo's had us with the mentality of win every inning, and if we do that, we, should, we have a good chance to win in, in the late part of the game. We, uh, we definitely, we li I guess we like that kind of because we can, we can live off that we need to get it done or else we're not going to get to play anymore or else we're going to go home. So uh, definitely getting I, – I wouldn't want to do that in Omaha, though, because there's a lot better teams there. And uh, But definitely we're, we're going to give it our all there. It was just last year that TCU dogpiled at Dishfalk Field after defeating Texas in the Super Regionals. This year, however, there was no such activity when the Longhorns claimed the series to advance to Omaha. Our goal is always to win a national championship, and, and uh, that's why we don't have the big celebrations when we win a Super Regional. We don't have a big celebration. When we, I mean, that, that's just not our, um, our style. We're, we're out to win national championships, and, and um, you know, it's the first step. Um, you know, we've, we've achieved our goals, which is, uh, you know, win a regional, win a Super Regional, and now um, our overall goal is right out in front of us. And the older guys definitely do a great job, you know, telling the underclassmen, hey, we're not dogpiling. I mean, that's, that's leadership right there. When you actually get... Um, two or three of the older guys saying, hey, we're not dogpiling. It actually happens. I mean, that shows how much of a leader, you know, leadership we have on this team. It does show class, and it shows that, like, this, this was big, but it's not our, like, real goal. Our real goal is to win the national championship, and that's when we'll dogpile. Head coach Augie Garrido recognizes the perseverance and determination of his players, but he acknowledges that their success cannot be attributed entirely to the team. You know, in, in, in this particular environment, I'm, I am, I don't know that we would have held up if it hadn't been for our fans. I think our fans did more to win the game than at any other time during the year. There's been individual games throughout the year, and uh, I just want to thank them a lot for uh, what they added to the team's strength, and, and they should feel a part of the team in this one. Alex Stockwell, College Press Box.